Today, I'm gonna use infinite money in endless mode, but I have a different strategy. So, I have the Sinister Titan TV man this time, and the DJ Speaker man. Oh, wait, no, this is the DJ TV man. I don't know why I said that, but anyways. If we boost him, he's gonna go up from 60,000 to 90,000 DPS. Right now, I'm in the test game, by the way, so I won't actually be on the endless leaderboard in case I get really high. So, this is actually the best unit if you have a booster unit, like DJ TV man, because boosted, he does 90k DPS, which is higher than the upgraded Titan the cinema man 71k but evan still needs to make it where all units are compatible with all booster units so the titan clock man is probably number two because boost yeah will have 75k but i'm not gonna bring him even though he can stop the toilets for a little bit i'm gonna do this strategy so like and subscribe because if you don't then um, my editor is gonna put something scary on the screen Rah! anyways wait i i don't i just realized something real quick i do not need to bring these two farms because i'm gonna have infinite money i do not know why i equipped those they are not gonna be equipped any longer instead of those i'm gonna bring a healing unit like i think camera repair drone is probably gonna be the best it pretty much heals instantly but it has a charge and then speaker repair drone but now i have pretty much the best things i can equip i'll probably put one speaker repair drone one camera repair and then the rest as many sinister titan tvs as i can so let's go and now we have infinite money so very first thing i want to put the dj tv man right or actually i'll put these guys first and then i'll figure out a DJ TV man placement because we got to do the best placement possible. So these actually slow by 25% with their snowball attack and then oh they have a pretty big hitbox. Okay I can't put them super close together. I literally can't even fit them right there. I gotta put them like right here. So we'll put one of the camera repair drones right here to cover this entire area and then the speaker repair drone will go right here. He can walk across this entire area and it's pretty much in the middle so that should be fine. I'll put one like right here and we should probably start maxing these out just because I want to have everything maxed out and then I'll put two DJ TV men so one right here Ooh, I don't know that doesn't exactly cover some of me I, I think I'll put that one somewhere else I'll put one DJ TV man back here and then one DJ TV man right all right that is perfect so let me just upgrade these guys so I have quite a bit of area back here to put more sinister titan TV men of course I got to put like two the green lasers so since I have infinite money i can just keep changing my placement area and this just see where works the best so i'm thinking maybe right here because he'll get them in this area actually i don't know i i gotta i really want to just center this guy i only want to place two i chose to actually do three so we have this one covering this entire area this one covering most of this area which since this one's covering the bottom i could probably place this one more to the right and yeah, that should be good and then this one covers most of the front so i, I think we're good on that i can only put two more sinister titan tv men so i'll put one in the front right here and then oh i gotta figure out a way to fit this other one in here because i want him to still be boosted okay good he's still in there so now that we've got them all maxed out all we can do is wait so the good thing about these guys more dps than the upgraded titan cinema man but the bad thing is less range by like well i mean most of the upgraded titan cinema man's range attacks are like around this much there is his laser which has like 60 range so it's not really too bad but he can slow things down with his back things by like stabbing it which can stop it for 10 seconds but these guys can passively slow 25% with their splash damage snowball which I mean we still have green laser cameraman so that doesn't really matter too much but actually I, I think we should sell the speaker repair drone I don't think we need that I think the camera repair drone is gonna clutch up enough as long as I don't skip too much because we can always sell one of these guys and place another later it doesn't really matter because we literally we have infinite money. I barely fit this guy in here, but he's still in the DJ TV man's range just by like the very edge. So I'm gonna max him out. Now we have all 15 out of 15 units. It is time to just wait. Okay, we're all the way to wave 53 now, and literally nothing has gotten far at all. This is definitely a lot better than upgraded Titan to Cinema Man, especially since they're doing a lot of extra damage. Actually, it's not 90,000 because it's basically 25% more damage, and then like 25% less cooldown on that 25% more damage. But he's actually doing exactly 100,000 damage per second right now, which is pretty good. Here's the helicopter camo toilet. I think I forgot to show it in the update video, but here's what he looks like. His helicopter blades spin. Some of the old guys don't have spinning helicopter blades. And also the old, like, toilet that has multiple legs doesn't have an animation. He's just 
dude. But look at them go. They're actually getting pretty far this time. Well, not not early, not early. We're getting them right here. It's because these guys pretty much do like all the AOE damage. I'm pretty sure they have more AOE damage than the upgraded Titan Cinema Man because literally their snowball is splash damage. And then this blue thing is AOE damage. And the, the red circle is the only thing that is not AOE and it's their scythe. But I should probably not auto skip at least for now because sometimes the toilets are getting almost right here if i auto skip by the time toilets get back here more are gonna spawn and they're just gonna end up getting a bend i do not want that one to happen well now i'm on wave 61 and still nothing is getting far at all look at how fast the vacuum toilets are dying we have so much aoe damage and this is just a pretty solid strategy i only have five six seven eight nine out of the possible 15 sinister titan team even but we do need these guys to slow things down even more so that brings it up to 12 and then we need the boost so that's 13 14 and then the camera repair drone is number 15 just in case anything gets far now scientist toilets with literally 10 million health are spawning and they're still getting destroyed skeleton toilets had almost 7 million health and look all of them are almost dead by like halfway this is really really op definitely a better strategy than before i think one of the scientists nope both of them are still alive on wave 66 now let's see how fast the massive buzzsaw oven with almost 9 million health die 1.5 million 1 million 100 bro that is so fast on wave 71 things are still only getting to like right here i keep trying to stun this guy but i have the camera repair drone so they're not gonna wave 74 security guard toilet got like a third of the way through the map but we're already surviving really long i think i'm definitely gonna get past like wave 90 uh oh on wave 80 the toilet is getting really far wait why is he walking like that i have told the he why do you make the animation like that and he said oh lol I didn't know those were like, oh, well, he needs to fix it. Also, we kind of need to get him. He still has 11 million health left. And, um, uh-oh. Uh, I guess I'll sell this guy and put another one right here. This is not going too well. Okay, we still need to do 10 million damage. He's at 16%. So these three plus this one. So only four do enough damage. And then two more can hit him with the snowballs. I think we can get him. I think we can barely beat wave 80. Bro, I still do not understand how some people are getting to like 113 and that is pretty high oh no 2 million 1.5 million 1.2 800k come on we're about to get him we're about to get him yeah we got him barely uh oh things are starting to actually get far i mean last time with infinite money i think we lost on wave like 85 or something so we're definitely making it farther this time for sure okay here's wave 85 pretty sure this is the last time what we lost on and we're for sure gonna win this there are just two giants who toy us 20 22 million health, but but I'm gonna get them. Oh no, the turkey toilets are getting a little far. Look at that. They have almost, or wait, they had 37 million health. Uh-oh, I didn't even look at them. I didn't even realize. Wave 87 is also going pretty well. These only have 31 million health. I think we'll beat this one too. The wave 91 is where the difficulty shifts up quite a bit. We're finally the mutant pumpkin toilet boss. The next boss is gonna be the astro toilet if we survive that long. The mutant pumpkin toilet has 85 million health. 85 million. Maybe I should have brought that other guy instead of the speaker repair drone like the upgraded titan cinema man and i could have put him like maybe one here and one in the end so that he can like stop him twice oh no that only stopped him for 10 seconds in total i could have just brought the clock man in time for that 10 seconds but come on we need to get him 53 million 52 million 51 million 50 million <laughs> bro we're doing millions of damage like literally a million per second or more but he just has so much health wait we lost we lost the boss i just realized i just tabbed out for a minute and i thought we'd like get the boss and get to the next wave but nope we have lost to the boss with infinite money i, I put the guy I put the slowing guy I put the dj all of them were boosted with the dj but that still was not enough to win so maybe i should have put like maybe i could have figured out a way to only have two green laser cameramen and not put the healing unit and then i'd have like two more up Created their sinister titan TV men and then I think another like 20% thing and possibly could have beaten that but okay wave of 90 is the highest i've made it to so far then um yeah so that is how far we can get with that strategy and infinite money in toilet tower defense so subscribe like thank you guys for watching i'll see you all in the next video